morning, Jetty Rockers. Welcome back to Jetty Rock. As you can see, I'm back in the surf. I'm solo today. I couldn't get somewhere to go with me. She wanted to sleep in. It's beautiful out here this morning. We're going to try again for some whiting, hopefully some palos. It does look like I see some sand fleas, so maybe we'll be able to get some sand fleas today. So I'm excited to get this started. Wish me luck, and hopefully we'll catch something real soon, y'all. like the other day we'll be using some fish bites this is clam strips orange stuff seems to work pretty good i just got one fish bite up here and i got a fish bite and a shrimp on the next two i'm gonna start off with a three ounce pyramid it don't look too bad out here just using a standard surf triple rig check real quick see if these are sand yep they're sand fleas yeah we got sand fleas all right, so it looks like I'll be able to get some sand fleas here in a little bit. Let's start off with this. Let's see what we can come up with. Water feels awesome. Here we go. We got the first fish this morning. This feels pretty good. Yeah, this feels like a good fish right here, y'all. Is it a whiting, a palo? What is it? I think it just came off. Yeah, it just came off. Dang it. Came off right there. Man. All right, guys. I'm not having that much luck on the doggone shrimp, so I'm going to see if I can't get some sand fleas. Those are little. Look how small those sand fleas are. Those are little sand fleas. Those are not very big. <clears throat> Man, those are just little. I don't see any good ones. How small those sand fleas are and those things are little those are itty bitty sand fleas all right well one bunch right here if i have any luck on these Again, just little fleas. I mean, those things are small, man. Very small sand fleas. I'll try a couple of them on a hook. But those are little. Those aren't what I'm looking for guys we are hooked up finally hopefully i can keep this one on this feels like a good fish it's gonna be a nice whiting or a palometto what are you oh bummer that is not what i want that is not what we want at all This is not what we want. Bummer. Well, so far, we're not batting very good odds. Small sand fleas. 
hooked a fish, missed a fish, and then I caught a catfish. And I've been here, I'd say 45 minutes at least, maybe an hour. Pretty slow. Well, we got another one. Hopefully it's not a catfish. Please don't be a kitty cat. Well, that's a nice whitey. All right, we'll go with that one. All right, finally. 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 That's not a bad one to start off with. That is not a bad one. All right. Nice little whiting, y'all. That's a good one. Especially if this is going to be the smaller ones. That'd be awesome. But we are on the board finally. Nice whiting. Going in the box. Well, guys, we are on the board. We got one in the box. We can catch a couple more, I'd be really happy. But it has been very slow out here. But that was a decent whiting. Right, we got one here. This feels like a decent fish. Oh, yeah. yeah this feels like a good whiting. Hopefully, it's not a catfish. That's exactly what it is. Oh, bummer. Not what I'm wanting today. going fish well, we got one here feels pretty good hopefully it's not a catfish uh, it looks like a whiting it don't look like a catfish it looks like a good whiting it didn't just come off nope it's another dog on catfish oh my gosh no Can't believe it's just a bunch of catfish today. Ah, sucks. I hooked up again. I hope this ain't a catfish. I hope this ain't a catfish. Feels like a catfish. Oh my goodness, it's a catfish. This is such a bummer. Where is all the whiting? Well, y'all, it has been a super tough morning surf fishing. If I catch one more catfish, I'm going to call it a day. And whatever that is right there I got. I hope that's not a catfish. Come on, be a whitey. It's fighting a little bit different than the catfish. What is, it's a catfish. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, I'm gonna do one more. I'll give it one more shot, and then I'm I'm out of here. I'm starting to wonder why I even came surf fishing today. I did good yesterday. I caught 14 fish yesterday in the box, 13 whiting, one palometta. But I went further down south yesterday. I came up north today, and it did not pan out. 
I mean, the fish today is just not good at all. Unless you're catching catfish. If you want to catch catfish, it's been a good day. I don't mind telling y'all, that sucked. Way too many catfish. But I did go yesterday, and that's in a different video. But I do have some fillets sitting in the refrigerator. I did catch one whiting today. And we're going to clean that whiting real quick. So I will see you guys at the cleaning table. And we're going to do a catch and cook, y'all, with some whiting. Well, y'all, this just adds to my day. See out there? I was coming on to 95 and the lady slammed in the back of me. Total the front end of her car and did some damage to the back of my dad's truck. So I'm just in here waiting for this all to be over with and then I get home. But that is about how my day's been going. <laughs> Catfish, no, no whiting except for one, slow bite, and now a little bit of a car wreck. Well, y'all, here's the damage to my truck. Pushed the bumper in pretty good. Pushed it all the way up against the body of the truck. At least I can still open my tailgate. I already tried that. And then she folded in the side of my truck pretty good. Which really ticks me off because my dad gave me this truck right before he passed away. I tried my best to keep it good and somebody not paying attention tailgating me. I lay tailgating me for a good five miles and she finally hit me. So that sucks. All right, y'all. Well, we got our one whiting. We're just going to add this to the whiting I caught the other day. I'm going to do a catch and cook. So you just come in here behind the whiting, right behind the head. Flip your knife down. Go along that backbone. Put a little bit of pressure on top of the fillet and the fillet comes off real nice and easy same thing on this side whiting are one of the easiest fish to clean actually one of the fish I learned first learned how to clean I started cleaning fish learning on whiting so there you go we got that and now we're going to just skin it you just lay your knife on the against the skin just go on down got a little bit of pin bones right there cut it off like that. and there you go get a nice little whiting flake yes it's small but man that it does taste good all right y'all we're in the kitchen we got our whiting fillets here yes they're kind of small these are some small whiting but we got 20 fillets here and that is plenty for the three of us for a meal. So what we're going to do is I'm going to use my house saw tree. I'm just going to coat them real good. Just like that. I don't use no milk, no egg. Just the damp fillets and the dry breading. That's what I do. So we're going to just coat all these up pretty good. I'm going to wait for the oil to get to temperature. Which I like it at 370, 375 degrees. So as soon as that green light comes on, we'll be ready to cook these. It's that simple. Just a real easy fish fry. And whiting is excellent fish for a fish fry. That's about the only way that I eat whiting is fried. I've never tried them baked or any other way. Just mainly just fried. Can't go wrong with some fried whiting. So I'm going to get all these breaded and wait for that green light. And we'll start frying up some whiting. All right, we got the green light. So in goes our fillets. We're going to put 10 of them in first. these get to a nice golden brown and we'll take them out and they're gonna be so good y'all so good and for those of you who are saying wait a minute you only caught one fish in the video these are some whiting that I caught the day before which that's in a different video but since I only caught the one whiting I went ahead and did a catch and cook and we used the fish from the day before some of the fish 
But my one whiting is in here somewhere. Alright, our last batch is done here. Man, those look good. So we got 20 fillets here, which is 10 fish. So 10 of those whiting will feed my family just fine. That gives you just a little bit of an idea how many whiting, how far they go. And these were small whiting. These weren't big whiting at all. So you get some bigger whiting, you probably only need maybe five fish to feed your family. Now, we're also going to do some french fries or some crinkle cut french fries. I'm going to get those going and we're going to do a little taste test on these little bad boys. Well, all right, got my french fries in. So we're just going to grab one of these little bad boys right here. These things are good, y'all. Hot. It's beautiful white meat and it's very, very delicious. If I had to compare it to something, I'd say kind of like sheep's head. I'd say maybe a little better than sheep's head or like a, a crappie or something like that in fresh water. So very, very good fish to eat. They're plentiful, very sustainable. There's no regulations on them, no size limit, no bag limit. I think you're allowed 100 or something for the day, but there's no, re no need to catch that many. Or we caught 16 today, we're eating 10. That's plenty for your family, y'all. And what a great end to a very bad day. Wasn't a good day, y'all. Fishing kind of sucked. Luckily, I had these from the day before. Or I wouldn't have had anything to make a video out of today. And then we got in a little fender bender. Got some damage to my dad's truck. Got some other stuff going on. But I'm glad the day's over. And this is a great end to that day. Thank you guys very much for hanging out with me today. Even though it wasn't great fishing, but you know I like to keep it real with y'all. I like to show you the good with the bad. Because not every day can you go out there and slam it. It just doesn't happen. I don't care who you are. It just doesn't happen. And some days, it's just catfish. So I want to show you guys. Keep it real with y'all. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you could, hit that like button if you like the video, y'all. And that thumbs up, because that thumbs up helps us out a lot with the algorithm. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, y'all, please hit that subscribe button and that little bell for notifications so you get notified every time I put up a new upload. And until we see y'all again, tight lines, Jody Rockers. See y'all next time.